Hey there dreamers and welcome back. I am so excited because today we are going to be working on a brand new project. I am going to be bringing to life my first full-size audio animatronic. Yes, of course you will recognize her and if you don't, she is from Pyrus. This was gifted to me and I was just so, so excited to acquire her because gosh, she was there from Oh, gosh, from the 60s up until like 2017, right? So she was there a very, very long time. This uh, particular um, head was actually not used in the attraction, but it was a spare cast. So this is, you know, scale one to one replica of what's in the attraction. And if I'm going to be working on her body, I'm having her dress made. We have a lot to cover in today's episode. So dreamers, sit back, relax, cue the montage. Let's get started. <music> So the first thing I'm going to do is make this mannequin body um, like in the pose that she is. She's holding her hands up like this. So I have to cut these arms into a couple of positions and then um, adhere her head to the body. I have her covered right now because she is a lady and I don't want, you know, all her business out there for everyone to see. Um, but I will, uh, of course, make her a little bit more, shall I say? say full so that her dress fits her which I'm having custom made so um that's what I'm going to do first is adhere her head to the body and then change her arms around a little bit just so it kind of makes sense I actually have let me pull these some silicone hands that um I had from a pirate that I pulled out and I folded and I was like you know what I like these I think that these will look good um I just will have to paint them to match her her flesh tone and then I have her bonnet which I'm going to kind of plus, of course, because it actually, I don't know if she's in some sort of wedding gown because it does say buy a bride up there on the top. So I'm really not sure what the original Imagineers were going for there, but uh, I'm going to, like I said, do her pose and then um, I'll check back in with you when I put on her costume.
are all done. I had an incredible time working on this full figure animatronic prop. You know, to me, she was one of those figures that I was really sad to leave the attraction. So I had to have her in my personal collection. As I said before, I had a really good head start. This head was given to me by one of my managers. So I had to create her and just remake her in her honor, in her memory. And here she is. I hope that you all enjoyed this. If you did, let me know in the comment section what figure you would want me to recreate full size next. I have, I think, three or four in the queue, but I am always open to ideas, suggestions, recipes. So let me know, dreamers. And if you like this sort of content, please hit subscribe and ring that bell icon. That way you're notified whenever I upload a new video. I wish you all a wonderful day. Be nice to one another. And always remember, dreamers, not only to follow your dreams, but to chase them. Yo-ho! Later, dreamers!